Hey guys, what's up? It's your girl, Jasmine. <laughs> How are you guys? I missed you guys so, so much. Like you have no, you have no idea. You have no idea. You have no idea. <laughs> I really missed you guys. Um, I'm sorry I haven't really been making videos. I've been so, so busy with school. Like I really took on a lot this semester. I have like four classes and they all require me to like read, 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 like read like at least a hundred pages each class. So that's like 400 pages that I'm reading the night. Like kill me now. now. Alright, because that's too much. But anyway, that's not what I'm here to talk about. Today's Wednesday Talks with Jazz and I wanted to update you guys and I have actually some modeling tips to give you guys when going to a model casting. So, I guess let's get right into it then. To update you guys, as you know, I've been in school, I've been working two jobs, I said this in the last video, um, and yeah, I just don't have time <laughs> to make YouTube videos anymore. But since it was Columbus Day, you know they gave us two days off, so you know that's why I'm making a video. Like, I really did miss you guys, like, you have no idea, like, I miss YouTube, like, I feel like I'm gonna lose all my subscribers, don't leave me, please. <laughs> Don't leave me and bring your friends bring them back. Come on. Come on. Come on back if you left <laughs> I've still been on my other social media. So follow me on Instagram and snapchat on snapchat I actually have a new character there her name Bamisha and she cute <laughs> And you know I when I have like a little free time here and there or when I'm bored or I didn't need a little break from homework I get on snapchat and I you know become this character of mine so if you want to check that out you know you can check that out and follow me on snapchat and instagram because i post some of those videos on instagram as well um you can also follow me on facebook as well it's all the same so yeah i've just been really really busy but in those times where um in, in between times where i can i have been going to model castings and model searches and stuff like that um as you guys know i went to the tour and model search Unfortunately, I did not win. I was not in the top 10 or the top 4. It's all good. I, I was sad, you know what I mean, like any normal human being would be when you don't like get something that you really wanted. It really um, made me want to go harder, you know what I mean, like it made me want to push more and just keep going. Like that experience I had was an amazing experience and that was my first model casting and I feel like I did a really great job so, you know, I just... It just really made me want to go harder so in that moment when I found out like I was sad I was down a little bit but I didn't let it like defeat me and like oh I'm not gonna model no more I'm like oh no that was my first one I'm gonna keep it going okay like Tori you ain't want me that's fine you gonna want me later though I'm just saying <laughs> other than that congratulations to the the top 10 and the top four now I think they made a top four so congratulations to you guys uh, good luck with your journey so I didn't win that and I was a little down, but I was like, you know, whatever. And a family friend of mine uh, tagged me on Facebook in this um, model search for Ashley Stewart. So I was looking, I'm going, like why not? It's in the city, it's in Harlem, like I'm gonna go. <laughs> so uh, I, I texted my, my agent Lindell and I told him, he's like, yeah, you should go. I was like, yeah, but I need some pictures. <laughs> so I got some pictures and um, yeah, so I went down there and it was a great experience. Like, you have no idea, guys. Like, um, I went down there and basically what we had to do was hand in your picture, hand in the information that you wrote, wrote down. They gave us a paper to write down and, um, and then you walk the runway. And then that was it. it. It was simple. But for me, I never walked the runway before, ever, in front of nobody. Like, that was liter literally my first time doing it. So, it was... It was nerve-wracking for me, but you know, I was like, I don't care, I'm gonna own it, whatever, because I, like, low-key practiced in my house sometimes, <laughs> downstairs in my hallway, you know, walk in front of the mirror, like, mm, I got this. I didn't know that that's what it was, so I really didn't practice, like, at all when I went, but, like, I practiced before. So, I don't know, I, I, I guess, well, from the... Okay, let me just tell you. <laughs> so, I get down there, and, you know, I'm sitting down, and I'm talking to the other models and just having a good time you know and um and so okay she had everybody line up and we lined up 
by 10th and when you got up she asked your name where you from and your number i was lucky number 17 which is the day of my birthday so you know i feel a little lucky i was feeling lucky i was <laughs> and um she asked some people like a, an extra question but she didn't ask me so i was like whatever so um i answered i was like my name is jasmine williams i'm from orange county new york and I am lucky number 17. And she's like, okay, girl, show us your stuff. And I just ripped that runway, okay? Like, <laughs> I walked down, like, it was just like tunnel vision for me. Like, I didn't hear the music anymore once I started. Like, I didn't even hear the comments that she was saying. Like, I didn't hear anything. All I know is that when I turned back around to come back, you know, I took off my jacket, swung around, you know, <laughs> I did all that extra stuff. You know, so now I could walk and I could do this, right? So, uh, I get back at the end and all the ladies are standing there and, you know, there's a crowd and they're all like giving me high fives. I'm like, yeah, girl, you did that. And I was like, oh my God, really? <laughs> I was like the only one that got like high fives in the first couple, like 20 basically, because I didn't stay the whole time. But, um, yeah, so it was like, I was the only one that got high fives from everybody. It was like weird. And I was like, okay, this is cool. And my boyfriend came with me and he was so supportive. And he helped me so much because let me tell you, I had heels on and I don't wear heels like that. So I had a problem trying to get back to the train. <laughs> Besides the point, later on, I will tell you some tips, okay, when you're going to a casting. But anyway, um, but yeah, and so then he tells me, because I was like, I really didn't hear anything. Like, it was this tunnel vision. So the whole thing was to win, to be uh, in the model, in a, in a fashion show for Ashley Stewart. And um, and Tyson Beckford was going to be the host. So I'm telling you this because the host, she was like saying, this is what my boyfriend told me. She's like, okay, girl, you know what you're doing. You're trying to see Tyson Beckford. And I was like, I, I really didn't hear any of that. But when my boyfriend told me, he was like, yeah, she was like going OD saying, you know what you were doing. And I was like, but <laughs> I was like excited and happy. And you know, after that, like it was just it was just the vibe there with, you know, all these beautiful plus size women. It was just like a great experience. It was like for me, it's like I like going to these things because it's more experience for me. It helps me practice more and it just I don't know, it builds my confidence even more as a model. So that's basically it. <laughs> um and then Saturday, this Saturday, actually the 15th, I'm supposed to go to another modeling search uh for rep dolls and this is a website online i love their clothes it's so amazing you guys should go check it out um their clothes are amazing from zero to like 32 i think their sizes go to or 28 i don't know it's a it's it's a wide range so go and buy some stuff from them okay <laughs> but yeah i have a modeling search on saturday to go to so i'm excited about that like i'm really excited to just keep going to these castings and stuff so to get right into the modeling tips, I don't want this video to be super long because y'all be like, damn, Jasmine, you be talking. Like, you be talking too much. <laughs> so, I'm trying to keep it short. But, um, I have a few modeling tips in my handy, handy dan that found. And, um, just when you're going to a model casting, I think these are, th what I've learned, is like the most important things that you should do or you should have in go <laughs> to a modeling casting. So, or a model search or whatever. Um, I feel like because of my experiences, I need to tell you guys like what to do and what not to do. <laughs> so here are some tips. Just a few. I think there's like seven. Um, bring heels. Make sure you either bring heels or bring extra shoes or bring both. You know what? Bring both. Bring both. <laughs> bring a pair of heels and bring a pair of cute like flats or something that you can walk in after the fact. Okay? Wear the heels there to the casting because they want to see that you can walk in heels um that's part of being a model even stand in heels you know what i mean so bring a pair of heels simple heels nothing crazy um and make sure you bring some flats or something because i learned the hard way <laughs> and when i tried to walk back from, to the train i had like i don't know my foot was like sliding in the in the shoe and i had like these really bad blisters under my under my feet and I couldn't walk the next day it was really bad like I was walking in school on the side of my feet like it was really bad <laughs> so take it from me make sure you bring extra bad shoes because best believe Saturday I'm bringing a whole bag of shoes <laughs> I'm not playing make sure that you have um a photo a headshot a full body shot something or a comp card and if you have a book bring that too 
it's always good to show like what you can do or what you know your pictures like that's what they want to see you're a model so make sure you bring that at all times um I think it's really really important sometimes they even ask for it in the model search so make sure you look at the criteria on like what you need what they're asking for because that's what they're gonna want don't wear a lot of makeup make it very like simple like you know a nice light layer of foundation if you don't if you don't need foundation don't wear it you no know, little lash little eyebrow nothing crazy little 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 shimmer on the lip this this look right here you see right here you see this is like perfect you can put a little color to the lip but don't make it bright you know i had um at the ashley model search i'll show in a picture at the end of the video i had a like a like a deep burgundy color because i was wearing nude and black so it, it kind of went um just don't do too much makeup don't put the false lashes on don't because they want to see who you are you know they want to see your face they want to see what they can work with so you coming bare or almost bare is the best thing keep your hair out of your face if you can don't you know have your hair on your face like you know put it behind your ear you can slick it all back what i did for the um the uh ashley stewart one is i had my hair up in a ponytail and it was nice and slick and chic kind of look um you just try to keep it out of your face because they want to see your face you know what i mean don't hide your face so that's i think that's a really big thing i've seen a lot of girls hiding their faces and kind of like shy with it but there was also a lot of girls that weren't hiding their faces so i feel like that's a really uh key thing that you should do is not hide your face and wear a lot like less makeup if you can also practice your walk <laughs> even though i had a great experiencing and i didn't like practice it right before still practice your walk if you want to be a model you need to practice your walk i went into this saying that i wanted i only wanted to take pictures as a model but as a model you being a model you have to do some kind of runway especially if you get booked and if you want these big bookings you're gonna have to do some kind of runway so practice your walk um it's really important to do that smile at all times when you get there and sit straight up posture is key um i've learned that there was a a trick where you if you sit a little off the chair um if you sit a little off the chair you're, you're like bound to like sit up straight so if you do that that's like a really good tip and just make sure you're sitting straight posture and you're just smiling like don't sit there with me butt face don't sit there with resting bitch face <laughs> just make sure that you're smiling and you're interacting too um that's another point be social you know what i mean um talk to the other models like yes i know you're kind of in competition with them but still you never know you you talk to people you can make connections they could be going to a model search that you didn't even know about now you know because you talk to them you know what i mean it's really key to be social and people you know the agencies and stuff want nowadays a social likable person so when you show them that even if they even if when you think they're not looking they're looking so be social have fun that's another thing like have fun it's a fun thing to do don't be too nervous i mean i yeah i mean i was nervous but i wasn't too too nervous like, to the point where i was like oh, i wasn't like that <laughs> i was like oh i'm nervous it was like that you know what I mean? like don't be too nervous have fun it's it's something that you know for me i feel like something that i want to do and i love to do and i enjoy doing it so i'm gonna have fun doing it you know um so you know that's basically it for the tips um, the ashley stewart model search they were actually supposed to let me know or let everyone know they said to everyone be free on the 15th from three to seven so me going to the city to the Rev Dolls casting. I'm just going to stay in the city all day Saturday until I hear something from Ashley Stewart. So hopefully I get, <laughs> I, I win and they pick me. I'm praying. I mean, if God willing, honestly, if, if it's not, if it's not for me to win that, I'm totally fine with it. Because again, like I had another experience and it's just another experience in the book where I can learn and you know just practice it's just practice for me so guys just keep in mind that if you want to become a model a plus size model these things do take time um i was fortunate to have a lot of things come to me quickly but you know now it's kind of slowing down because it, it takes time it, these things take time and you have to have practice and make a few mistakes and stuff so um yeah i don't know <laughs> That's basically it. I really hope that you enjoyed these tips and these tips really are helpful for you, especially if you're trying to become a model. Um, and I hope you, you know, still love me because <laughs> I know I haven't been posting videos. 
<laughs> I'm sorry. I'm gonna come back. I mean, this semester is really bad. Like, it's really bad. I really need A's and B's, so I'm sorry, guys. Like, I'm gonna post on my break. So, probably around Thanksgiving. I'm, I actually want to make another video soon. I, I don't know. I have, a, I have a lot of things um in mind of what I want to do. So, I, I, I can't really tell you when exactly I'll make another video or when I have another video ready for you guys. But, just be on the lookout and make sure you subscribe so you can get the notification, you know? <laughs> Um, I love you guys so so much for loving me and supporting me and watching and I will see you guys next time Make sure you guys get on them social media snapchat Instagram Facebook follow me Okay, cuz I'll be on there. You know what I'm saying you love me you want to see more of me <laughs> You can follow me on there <laughs> Okay guys, I love you again. Bye Hey guys, what's up? It's your girl Misha, <laughs> how are you guys? I really don't want to be in class right now. Like, why do I have to go to class? Why? Why? Why can't I sleep? Demisha is overwhelmed and tired and stressed and tired and stressed and I don't no no more. Y'all thought I was playing when I said like Demisha's a real character on Jasmine's Snapchat. Like, hello, I'm here. How are you? And best believe you heard it first from me, Demisha. Hello, cause I don't want nobody else to be like, oh, I'm Demisha now, and then they get famous over it.